Hello everyone. How are you doing? As I announced in a community post some days ago this video is a collab with Extra, another awesome but way underrated content creator and friend of mine. If you would just take a minute to hit that subscribe button on her channel. You would really make her day. For those of you who would like to watch part 2 of this series I will link it in the description along with her channel. Now let's get straight into the video. Saturday morning in the class 1 of GC. Broccoli Greenheart is online. Good morning guys. You won't believe what I just found out. Also breakfast is ready. Good morning Dikukun. Good morning. I'll just change real quick and then I'm Mark come downstairs. Good morning everyone. Sup Midobro. What is it that you found out? You'll see sweet smiling face. The girls and I are already on our way. We sure are. Mina begging for the tea to come. I'm curious too. Is it a secret you are gonna reveal? Did you find my cheese? It is delicious isn't it? Sparkly delicious cheese emoji. Dot dot dot. You had cheese in my room again? Please stop it. I rarely notice that you hide it and never find it in time. Worried broccoli face. EWW rotten cheese ain't delicious at all. That's why it always smells like rotten cheese in your dorm. It does. Also I can help you midobro. No thanks. Deku questioning Dunky's free time activities. Could you just stop it Aoyama or just place it somewhere obvious? Or he could just give it to you instead of hiding it. Yeah. Secretly a softy pleased kissing face is online. Stop spamming the GC. My alarm is already annoying enough. Good morning sleep ahead. Breakfast is ready. Who changed his nickname? It fits perfect doesn't it? Proud tea queen. So it was you? I don't think it was a. Damn pinky. Calm down back your gal. Everyone is waiting for you. I'll come in some minutes. Let me wake up for once, you fake spiderman. Secretly a softy pleased kissing faces went a flying. Mayo fake spiderman. Extremely hard laughing emojis. By the way it wasn't me. Totally not you. Face with rolling eyes. We don't believe you. Oh come on, I'm sure it was Deku. He is the only one who has seen his true side. Don't blame it on our innocent bean. Annoyed Mino with rolling eyes. In the common room of the class 1 dorms. Everyone was already here, sitting at the fully laid table. The sweet and savory scent of many different and delicious dishes filled the common area and made many stomachs growl. Finally Bakugao is here. Now we can eat. Everyone got the food they wanted and started chatting with their friends. Thanks for the help Midoriya. It's no problem. I can help you more often with preparing breakfast if you want. As long as nothing catches fire I'd really appreciate your help. Both began to laugh and talked about their plans for today. Hey Midoriya. Wasn't there something you wanted to tell us? Some of the students next to them had heard Toru's question and turned around to listen more closely to the conversation. Yeah that's right. He said, he found something out. Is it the type of cheese our sparkly cheese prince is hiding? Only the best for the best. That's kinda cute. Rather weird if you ask me. Tell us Midoriya. What is it? A secret? If yes, whose is it? Tell us already. I don't have time for this. Just listen to what he wants to tell us. Whatever but make it quick. I'm so curious. What are the big news? Let me show you. He lifted his hand as if to make a powerful gesture before the announcement but it was silent, as no words left his mouth. His classmates and friends just stared at him, wondering what is going on. Didn't you want to show us something? Mina looked at him with a questioning face as a surprised yelp was heard next to her. The young heroes turned around and saw Karishima's stunned face. His eyes looked straight at an object floating in front of his nose. Guys, why is my bread floating? Wow that looks so cool. Maybe Eurerica touched it. No. Why should I use my quirk on a piece of bread? Maybe you wanted to prank him? That's rather your job. For real though why does it float? Does anyone else in here have a gravity defying quirk? Probably it's just Tora messing around. Karishima leaned forward and moved his hands around his food to check if he could feel any hands touching it. There is nothing. See it isn't me. The familiar voice came from the other side of the table, 
Where the invisible girl was just enjoying her cup of tea. Who is it then? Just a split second after Ciro's question the slice of pastry began to smoke and little, though hot flames blazed up. The bread went up in flames and as there was not a single crumb left, it fell apart into tiny flakes of ash and slowly fell on Ijiro's plate. To make sure the fire was completely put out, Todoroki placed some ice on top of it. Okay what the hell just happened? Didn't you guys realize that Deku hasn't told nor showed us anything yet? Maybe that is what he wanted to show us? A burning bread? Are you sure? It was just an idea. That leaves the question how did Midoriya do that? Oh my god. It's his quirk. He has a new quirk. How else would he have been able to do that? For a minute everyone let the words Denki told them cross their minds. It made them think, a lot actually. However it confused most of them. Now everyone looked at Izuku with a confused and curious glance, seeking for answers. Is it true what that lightning rod just said? 